Hey guys, Pedguinea, and today we are playing Terraria. This is episode 36, and last time we were making a new world and we are looking for those goddamn living trees. Alright, so last time we literally found like nothing, which is pretty upsetting because last update there was an update where it was like 100% guaranteed chance that you're going to get treasure in the, uh, in the trees. And now we can't find any. It's like that's the one thing we've been like looking for. And we went for a whole episode without finding one. So hopefully we'll be able to find some living trees. And if we can't do that, we'll just go look for penguins because that's what I like doing. I'm not going to stop until I get a penguin because there's not a penguin in my original world. And we're going to find one eventually. So, ah, oh, another crimson world. Not my preferability, pe preference, I guess. Um... I swear it's like 75% chance you can get crimson. It's bloody... It's awful. Hopefully we can find some palm trees as well because we got some of the wood le uh, last game and that was pretty interestingly different. Alright. And hopefully we can find some more of those underground tombs as well. That's why I use this sword. So a lot of you guys are glad that I'm back making videos. Um, hopefully we can make it last a lot longer. Um, oh yeah, I also made a new video on a game called Korea, apparently. Apparently I pronounced it wrong. I called it Korea when it has an A at the end. So it's like Korea or Korea or whatever. Someone in the comments said it was like Korea, but with a C. So I, I don't know if it's supposed to sound like Korea or not, but <laughs> um, but apparently I pronounced it wrong in the video. But it's a new, it's a new game, I guess. So... Uh, I was I was opening it into interpretation. If you've not seen that video, you should check it out. It's pretty much a mix of Terraria and Starbound, um, but it has like a leveling system at the same time, which is really really cool. It's actually really interesting. Like everything you do gets like uh, XP and whatnot. That's cool. I've not seen this potion before. So everything you do pretty much gets XP. So if I kill something with magic, I'll get magic XP. If I kill something with a sword, I'll get sword XP. Yada, yada, yada. Um, if you, like, dig, you'll get mining XP. Collect stuff, you get collecting XP. And the list goes on and on, pretty much. Whoa, calming potion. Reduces enemy aggression. How does that even make any sense? I want some more of those potions. Alright, we didn't get any. <laughs> it's alright. I think there's a bunch of new um, potions added. I've just not got a chance to check them all out. Alright, we're getting towards the end of the world now. So hopefully we'll get some palm trees. I'm not sure if they're just like randomly in deserts. Or if they're actually like supposed to be at the end of the world. I'm assuming it's the end of the world. It's the end of the world as we know it. And I feel fine. Where is it? I swear the end of the world gets really, really strange recently. Because if you remember last episode, there was just a massive wall that I had to like go around, and it was really buggy. So I'm, I'm kind of curious if there's like some errors in the most recent patch. Like, is this supposed to be a desert or a beach? Like, I'm, I'm kind of confused right here. A tiny floating island. Is that it? Usually gets the end of the world pretty quickly, but it seems. What? Okay. Should I grab some of this then? Why not? Starfish. Alright. I don't need that much of that stuff, because this isn't even... Yeah, it's not even materials. Oh, only two trees? Are you serious? Can you plant? Oh, I didn't even get any acorns. I don't even know if those acorns work or anything. Alright, might as well jump in the water to see if we can get any goodies. Alright, one set of goodies. Oh, increased placement spe speed and range. Alright, when we do another building episode, that'll probably be good. But I don't think we're going to do another building episode until we get the goddamn living tree crafting bench, or whatever it is. Because the house looks pretty ridiculous. And they changed the update, so we needed, like, that. Uh, we used to be able to make craft, like, living backward just by standing next to a living tree right and they changed it so you have to actually have a living crafting wood chest or whatever it's called so it's completely changed like what we have to do to get the items so it's like completely role reversal 
It's kind of upsetting. Alright. Hopefully we'll find something. I'm expecting a parcel apparently, so I might have to jump up halfway through this episode. My mum's just text me. If we don't find any living trees, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go crazy. Because we, we found loads before. And they're not even that, like, non not common or whatever. You're supposed to always find at least one on, on every planet. Or, or world, I guess, as you would call it. But, because planet implies you can go to others, I guess. Oh, well. Uh, a couple of you guys last episode were telling me to kill Plantera, which I, I think I'll consider pretty soon. I think my gear is pretty good. And we do know where some uh, Plantera locations are, so we might just uh, make like a little arena. Like I did in my 20 hour playthrough, what I did was I I made a little arena. And whenever I, I killed like Plantera like, I don't know, like five times during that. And um, what I would do is I'd run to the arena, even though like... I it, it spawns somewhere away from the arena, so I'd, I'd I'd always use the same arena. So I think I'd use the same tactic there. This is a large world, I believe. What a terrible chest! Recall potions are probably the least helpful for me right now, especially because I have this magic mirror. Maybe if there was like enemies that could silence you and you couldn't use your magic mirror, and you had to use like some alternative ways to get home, you could use it potion or if there was like a quick button for the potion maybe it would be pretty helpful but I don't see why they should make it different from the magic mirror just because it's a, like a new item or whatever it should have been added a long time ago to be honest but I mean I guess it helps with making new characters because you're not guaranteed to get a magic mirror in every world you join wow we've literally came to another world and there's not been one living tree this is abominable strange hmm where's my palm wood palm wood's really cool I really like it okay I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna go to the ice biome because I want a bloody penguin I was made for finding penguins look at the biomes right here so we can just jump straight in I think there was an opening not too far in yeah there's one over there Though it is quite near the corruption. I swear, whenever there's corruption, it's next to the ice biome and it just bloody destroys it. It makes me cry. Oh, apparently you guys were telling me to use quick mine. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Oh my god, you guys are awesome. So if I go that way... Oh my god, that's really cool. Oh my god. I can't believe I, I didn't realise this last episode. Thank you guys. You guys are the best. So this is how it works. This is going to be really cool. I can just press. Oh my god, that's so cool. This is like no effort. This is actually probably the best update Red's done in a long time. Wow. I can't believe I was like fiddling with it last episode. This is amazing. Makes the he elevator so easy too. Make I'm gonna have like so much more time on my hands for making like wow you can go up as well that's crazy. Haha, <laughs> this is awesome. I don't have much to do here like this though. All right. Might as well just like explore the area really quick. As you can see, it unlocks it for my map. Which isn't too bad. It's a bit below us. But I want to just check over here real quick. Oh wow. Okay, let's just go down then. Because we're just going to be digging forever if we go that way. And I d we did see an opening just here. Alright, there's some more down there. Diggy dig dig.
Oh, grab this, why not? Always grab life crystals because even if you've got full HP, you can use. Um, oh, there's another one over there. I want to grab it. They do actually sell for quite. Do they sell for quite a bit? Isn't it 50 silver or something? So if you do get like, just so happen to get loads of them, you could actually just sell them all. Um, but you can use them for heart lanterns, which increase your HP gradually, which is really really cool. There we go. Is that a chest over there? Oh, I thought I saw one. I feel like they've lowered the percentage you can get chests as well, just to spite me. I really want a bleeding penguin. Is there anything else we need from the ice biome? I can't remember. I remember I was looking for ice skates before, but I think we got them. So I'm not completely sure what else I need. This is crazy, why is there no... There's no nothing. Ooh. Let's go check that then. Oh yes! A nice chest. See, so I use the Splunker Potion and then we find a chest that's not even in like a dark area. Ice skates, god damn it. Oh, I'm so sad. Alright, actually let's... Let's trash this. This and this. Actually, I'm going to keep them because I probably can sell them. And I'm going to grab the chest as well. Actually, I don't need these seashells. If I ever need them for like decorating or something, I can probably figure out a way to do that. A better way. I mean, I'll just grab them when I need them, to be honest. I mean, they don't, they're not used for materials or anything. Keep on going. Wow, there's some loud cars outside. That's not even a car, it's a van. Hmm, I don't think I need to unlock them. There's nothing, unless there's something new that I've not heard about. Keep on going. There's another heart, why not grab it? Thank you very much. So yeah, make sure you give uh, your suggestions for what you should do next episode. Also, if you guys like Cree and want to see more of it, let me know. Um, because I was enjoying it. I mean, I'd, I'd gladly do some more episodes on it, but it depends what you guys want. I think it might be pretty cool. I'm going to definitely keep my eye on it, so if there's like an update on the game um, about something that's really interesting to me or something, I'll probably do some... Oh, I don't know. I'll check it out, and if it's interesting, I'll do like a video on it. But I don't know, like if I'll do a, a massive series on it. It depends. I mean, it is different, so maybe. We finally found a big area like this. Hopefully we can find some chests of sorts. That would be lovely. Lovely jubbler. This whole area we've been in and we've not even found more than... Well, we found one, I guess. That doesn't count. Ah, there we go. Yeah, another chest. Sweet. Please be a penguin, please be a penguin. Why can't I open it? Ah! Oh, ice blade. I don't like you, ice blade. Hunter potion. Meh. Iron bar. Meh. I'm going to replace some of those arrows with some gel, just so I can get 99 gel, because I think gel is going to be more u useful. Then, uh... Also, someone suggested I do that, anyway. Um, 
Also, I think Joe's going to be more... Ooh, platinum chandelier. I don't want it. Um, I think Joe's going to be more useful than just normal arrows at the moment. Especially because I could make fire arrows out of them. What is that? Uh, oh, it's just something shiny. It wasn't even anything. How strange. Ugh. Do, 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 do. More chests, please. That's the whole area that we've searched. I remember when I, the, the update first came out. I don't know if time just flew or I, I got really lucky, but I swear I found a penguin like immediately first. Because that's one of the first things I did when the up, the 1.2 update came out. I just ran straight into the, uh, the ice biome. Because that w had like a big revamp on it. Because what it used to be just before was just ice. That was it. There wasn't even that much to it. I think it was just like left over from the um, the Christmas update. Like there was a small chance you could get an ice biome. And then they put penguins in and then they went all out. Ah, that's the end of the ice biome to the left. Sigh. Talking about Sai, have you seen his new video? It's very interesting. It's very weird. It's got like 20 or 30 million views already. That's crazy. He is loaded now. Angel statue. We got three of those last episode. I'm pretty sure we could make like a whole area of these. Oh, two life crystals right next to each other. If I was a new character, I'd go crazy for them. Whoops. Let's kill this guy just in case he gives us something good. Nothing. Ow. Hmm. Right, let's get to the right here. Any chests anywhere? Okay, let's go a bit further down. It seems my eater gets really lost sometimes and just starts flying around. How strange. The uh, enemies don't seem to... Actually, I think... You think this item would be pretty good? Where is it? Reduce the enemy aggression. Like, if I did that whilst I was doing a boss fight, would it just be like a 1v1 and all the other mobs would just bog off? And what what extent does it work? Like, does it only work on slimes? Does it work on everything? Does it work on bosses? Like, enemy aggression? Like, does the boss just, like, get a cup of tea out? Possibly. Ow. Hmm. Whoa. I don't think I want to use another thingy just yet. Please, Peng. Oh, actually, I like killing these. Hook. That's it. Oh, actually, there's a heart right there. Might as well grab it. I like. Uh, I like it when I get like the uh, the mining stuff, like the mining pants and stuff. Because when you get like the full set, I like giving it my uh, like statue. Actually, apparently, there's weapon racks now. Oh, we should have done that. Someone remind me next episode. Weapon racks. All right. I think that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I'm going to cut it out here. 
I'm expecting a delivery apparently. My mum just texted me. So I'll keep my eyes out. And I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hopefully we'll be able to do... Actually, I want to check out the weapons right next episode. Someone remind me, but I'll probably, probably remember. <laughs> so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys later. Bye!